Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. It's uh, time for another review and it's another micro brand. Today I'm checking out the Van Banner PM 2.0. Van Banner is a Canadian micro brand and LV run, who runs the uh, Van Banner has some really interesting designs, some awesome colorways. Just check out his AO and uh, <clears throat> they're just fun. Watches should be fun, not everything is dead serious. PM 2.0 stands for Parking Master and I'll get to what that's all about in a little bit. Really interesting angular design. We have a 40 millimeter case for the one millimeter bezel and log to log distant. I'm still at my parents house like I said and my dad has some tools that I don't have <laughs> but I should get you now about a let's see if I can get it about a 40 there we go about a 47 log to log the the bracelet 20 millimeter bracelet flares out and real tapers down really nicely at the clasp it's about 20 um, crown screw down crown at the uh, about 330 interesting choice let's move those hands out of the way on the dial we have there we go uh, on the dial itself that awesomely green dial we have applied indices angular shaped with some nice thick uh, hour and minute hand and a nice color red uh, um, second hand ticking away with the myota 9039 movement we have a ceramic bezel insert bezel action 120 clicks no back play, aligns perfectly. Really, really nicely done. It's one of the best bezels I've handled, to be honest. Now, countdown bezel, what's that all about? Well, I parked my car. I set the timer for 30 minutes. There we go. When I have 10 minutes left, it goes on the red. Uh, on the yellow, sorry. <laughs> on the yellow. When I have five minutes left, it goes on the red, and I really need to hurry up and get back to the car. Unless I'm gonna get a ticket. Printed Van Banner logo at the 12 o'clock, automatic 200 meters of water resist at the 6 o'clock. We have a nicely branded clasp, push button milled. Really nice. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Micro just which will make this a perfect fit. We have a see-through case back, but with that touch, it's branded. Cool, haven't seen anyone do that before. The bracelet with its 20 millimeter lugs is solid. We have quick release spring bars, and it's really, really nicely articulated. And since I'm outside, you can see how nicely it plays with the lights. Before I go into the loo, moans and niggles, uh, as Jody likes to call them. There's only one moan and niggle, to be honest, and that's the sharpness. The case is really sharp. Uh, this edge should have been sanded down, maybe. Chamfered edge, something like that. This edge needs to be smoothed out. And all in all, it's a bit on the sharp side. Will it hurt when I wear it? No. It's a super comfortable watch. Uh, taking off my Seiko Panda, review coming up. Gonna put it on wrist, my roughly 17 centimeter wrist. And it wears nicely. It's a nice chunky diver. Uh, it does have male end links, but they angle down nicely at a, about a 45 degree angle. Makes it hug the wrist really, really well. Lastly, some lube. 
I'm gonna see if I can show us some loom even though it's sunny still. We have some really awesome loom. Uh, we have different color loom on the on the bezel insert. We have really strong loom on the hands. Really hard to show off, but it's a loomed crown, the PM parking master. It's a really cool watch. And the, the new batch comes also with a thick mesh and I believe a NATO strap. So go check them out. Uh, Van Banner watches. Really cool, interesting, different, fun watch. Okay guys, that's it for this time. Until next time, take care, stay safe and bye bye.